Have you ever wondered how Yannick Sinner hits those powerful, powerful backhand shots? Oh, what? <laughs> let's understand the biomechanics behind this. First, let's talk about the inside-out swing part. Now, don't confuse this with an inside-out shot. Totally different thing. What we're talking about is how the racket moves from the slot. Basically, the position right near your body where the point of contact is. Sinner generates power and control through his swing by keeping his grip close to his body and using his arms as a lever. This creates significant distance between the contact and his body, facilitating an inside-out swing part with more torque, more spin and tons of more power. But here's the part that most people miss. Sinner doesn't actually swing early. He actually swings late. But everything is loaded and ready to fire. If you freeze frame his swing, you'll see the butt cap of the racket points left and the racket tip faces the right. It means that he's coiled like a spring and right before contact, he releases that stored energy. But did you know that he learned all of this while doing something else? Comment part two to know what it was.